my past self being recorded, giving a message to all my future selves that will watch this video, um, and to others if they watch. I'm just going to talk about things I've been observing, like today so, and other times. I've looked up at the clouds and it looks like the sky, the clouds, it just doesn't look like it's moving at all, like it's perfectly still. And then I like look away and then I'll look back and like the clouds have changed. Like maybe they dissipated, but as a before when I was just like, staring at it, looking at it, it wasn't moving at all. That was kind of strange and maybe they do dissipate and then because uh, other times, a long time ago when I watched the clouds, they would like disappear and then other parts would appear in parts of the sky that were just blue sky. They'll just show up, you know, appear and then disappear. Um, and then there's other times where it's more windy up there and it's blowing it across the sky so where it's not like sitting still. So I guess that's how clouds are. I don't know if that's being controlled or not, but, or, you know, there might be a part that might be an image and the other part is just like underneath it might be actual clouds because I saw something where it created clouds before. <clears throat> it's kind of interesting. And if there's like a drought, why don't they just use their cloud machines that they have, like NASA's cloud machine, to make it rain and make places like Lake Mead or whatever in California have like a full amount of water? Why don't they do that to help the planet out so it won't suffer, so people won't suffer? and so people won't go out and plants will be beautiful and everything will look nice and green. Why let everything get super dry? Um, because I'd like to be able to, instead of seeing just dry green, dry things, to be able to see greens and um, before, if I needed to forage for food to be able to have it available because when it's dry you can't forage as easily for food if there's no other food coming. Um, like I was, because I saw a video also about someone teaching about how you can spot things in the grasses of different plants you can eat. You know, like dandelion and other things. Um, and other types of leaves, like clover leaves that are edible. I've seen bunnies eat the um, plants out there, the greens, like there's probably wild lettuce out there somewhere, but the problem with it being out just in the wild, sometimes you worry about animals might have peed on it or something like that. Anyways, I'll um, link a video to that cloud machine, seeding machine, no, not a seeding, but cloud creating machine, NASA. Um, they should have more of those for places that are too dry that like the lakes that need water that are going dry. They shouldn't just let it go dry like that. It would solve the problem. Okay, bye. Um, I'm back and I think I know why maybe they won't do the cloud machines because it wouldn't be natural and at least <laughs> if it is all natural and they did the cloud machines that wouldn't be natural and I, I watched a movie about somehow they were making weather with some kind of electric stuff um i forgot what it was it's about a storm that got out of hand and was causing a lot of problems because they did it a man-made type thing that just it just didn't i forgot what the movie was called but it's an interesting one um, where like bad storm would pop up because of their manipulation.
I hope that it's natural and it's not manipulated and I hope that I hope that God will make it better someday that people don't have to suffer or maybe the earth just goes through these type of things maybe it's just a cycle it's been through it before in other places and throughout the world probably and um, it's just another cycle and but maybe it's a great cycle not just a little cycle who knows we don't we may or may not know I'm not sure that's just another thought I had I'm feasting on my dinner which is pizza buns I made the buns they're like um, buns with cheese on top and garlic like garlic pizza buns garlic cheesy pizza buns Here's the top, so I just cut it in half. I put sauce and, and mozzarella cheese on top. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Ideas, ideas. Talked about why, why couldn't people just make it rain? Instead of making everybody lose their water and not have electricity and water why force people to suffer um. like, I wouldn't even want I don't even want bad people to suffer like that. That's how, how I, much love I have for everybody overall, even though I, I don't like what they do sometimes. Um, like, when you think about all these people from other countries, like, different countries I don't know all of them there's different so many different countries different languages different races mm. how they treat things differently than other people treat because of you know like communism or not yeah even our country is like the leaders are the people they're doing the bad things a lot of times. Um, yeah, I don't know if it'll ever change. How they treat animals, some of them. Even your own, own your country you think is good, it might not be good at all. In the universe. Yep, yeah, or they could be good and not know it. I don't know. It's so it's unknown. Just don't know what's what's going on. You know, like some people know and some people don't. I like, I don't know. I think I have to go day by day. Every day, day to day. Sometimes I get surprises in my days. Mm. Other days are just a regular day. No surprises. Um, I wondered about that. Uh, Star in heaven. Um, everyone has a star. What does that mean? What does that mean? As I heard that the stars were like billions, uncountable stars. But there's limited amount of people. Bucket. 
If there's more stars than people, how could each person have a star? And if they're not real, then how could each person have a star? What does that really mean? Uh, like, like that, like Elon Musk, um, has a, what's his thing called, Starlink? So each person has a star, does that mean like one of those, um, things above, and the thing is where we have a star, like a star link. Is that what that means? Not sure. Like at the internet type thing in the sky that Elon Musk made. Or create, somebody did it. I don't know who, it's supposed to be his unless someone else, did he sync that one up? Not sure. Um, like today, okay, did I even say what day it was? Today is June 22nd, 2022. Um, talking about the clouds today and about <clears throat> the other things. Oh, and about like, the flesh is like, uh, the flesh is Satan and is the flesh Satan? Yet we live in the flesh and that's why we have a warring with the spirit in the flesh, that's in our spirit the warring that goes on because of our flesh. Um, yeah, it's, it's a blessing. The flesh is amazing too because when you when you heal, your body heals. It's crazy how wonderful it is. And like your sensations and the feelings you have when you feel love from people and you care and intimacy and all that. <clears throat> it's nice feeling someone puts, you know, showing love and care, holding hands or um, giving a massage or something like that. Just something that's not, it's just a nice caring feeling you get. Because intimacy is important between two people and other people. Mm. Anyways, I can't think of anything else right now. I'll come back later.